With the latest from News 4 Jax, I'm Mary Bear. Tonight we're learning that yesterday's tornado was an EF1 with wind speeds up to 110 miles per hour as it touched down in the Goodbees Creek area of South Jacksonville and moved north nearly four miles through San Jose across I-95 and into Arlington, leaving a trail of debris in its wake. That from a report released this afternoon by the National Weather Service. And meanwhile, the National Weather Service says the twister that touched down yesterday near Kings Bay in southeast Georgia had peak wind speeds of 130 miles per hour. The National Weather Service also says 17 people reported injuries after the tornado flipped over trailers and vehicles in an RV park. And we've also learned the name of the man killed by a falling tree yesterday as Tropical Storm Elsa moved through North Florida was Deshaun Johnson. His family identified him to News for Jax. A public affairs officer for the Naval Air Force Atlantic told News for Jax that he was assigned at the of the War Eagles of VP-16, which flies and maintains the P-8A Poseidon Air craft at NAS Jax. Johnson leaves behind a wife and two children. Always the latest news online at newsforjax.com.